Yes, sir. Islam comes after everything else fails. We know that Islam comes after everything else fails. Everything has failed us. We're living in a government that's made it illegal for black people to read at the time and said that we were only three-fifths of a citizen and said that we didn't even count as a whole person. So we know that the government of, of America has failed us. We, we go to church on Sunday, then we do a drive-by on, on Monday, and we know that the church has, has failed us. And now we'll go to a word from the Most Honorable Elijah Muhammad, the teacher, leader, and guide to us in, in, in America. We'll listen to a word from him. Okay, so actually, we'll read, we'll read this. So Islam comes after everything else fails. The Honorable Elijah Muhammad says this at the Ulan Arena speech, 1959. There is no leader or follower of a leader in America that can do so much as Islam has done for you and I. I'm here this afternoon with the solution for the so-called Negroes and his slave masters uh, problem. You're, you're not, uh, you are not sitting here this afternoon looking for me for foolishness. You are seeking something. You are seeking an answer to your 400 year old prayer. Your prayer for the last 400 years has been for justice. It was the cry of our fathers when they first landed in the Western Hemisphere. It was justice. That cry, that prayer, has ever been going up before Allah, ever since. But you have not received an answer. Everything else has failed you. No, everything has failed you. You have been greatly deceived and disappointed. The church has failed you. The Christian religion has failed you. Your leaders of that religion have failed you. Now the government of America has failed you. And he says, Islam comes after everything else fails. The church has failed us. Christianity has failed us. The government of America has failed us. What, what must be done when the civilized man fails to perform his duty? So we see he, sa he says that the, um, the church has failed us. We can't think, we don't find true brotherhood in the Christian churches, and we know that the unity that they profess is fake, false friendship of the devils, and we know that their friendship and their system, or Yaqub's, this grafted way of civilization has failed us, and God comes after everything else fails, and Islam comes, and he comes to, the, to return us. We have a prayer. Thanks, thanks to our God Allah, who, who, who came. Oh no, thanks, thanks to our God Allah and the person of Master Far Muhammad, the great Mahdi, who was to come and has come to return we who were lost from our own to the kingdom of Islam and to return and to destroy those who destroyed us. O oh Allah, please deliver us from our enemies and or, or deliver us from our murderers and we will serve and obey thee all the days of our life and teach our, our children thy praises and to submit to thee who has unequal love and mercy for us. No Allah, thank you for making manifest our enemy the devil and the oh Allah help us to die the death of a Muslim. Ameen. Aslam alaikum wa rahmatu Allah. Aslam alaikum wa rahmatu Allah. So we we say please God the great Mati comes to restore us to the kingdom of Islam after everything else has failed. And we know that it says in the Holy Quran, and certainly you have come to us by one as we created you at first and have left behind your backs what we gave you and we see not with you any inter intercessors about whom you asserted that they were Allah's associates in respect to you certainly the ties between you are now cut off and that which you asserted has failed you and it says indeed they have lost their souls and that which they forged has failed them so yes sir and then we see in the Bible here it says, um, you know that Allah never fails. Man will, man will fail you. Woman will fail you, but Allah never fails. He will never fail you. It says, 
and all that your hearts and all that your souls it says behold this day i'm going to win the earth and you shall know in all your hearts and in your souls that not one thing hath failed out of the good things which the lord your god spoke concerning you so we know not one thing that the lord said has failed but we know the government of america has failed us and islam comes in that personal moment at your lowest moment after everything else has failed you and she failed you and he failed you but allah will never fail you and this is the strongest it says the strongest handhold is the handhold with Allah. That is the strongest handhold. Shujalahu and Assalamu alaikum to the degree of the courage, mass point, sir.